I think uh, producer Randy and I have often agreed that if it's something that can lead to a police response, no longer is it really funny. Maybe what we should do is, is go to a consultant, you know, planning for next year to what might be a good idea or a bad idea for an April Fool's joke. Ladies and gentlemen, here is our consultant of all things moral and responsible, Christopher Walken. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> Glad you're having here. me on. Yeah. This way you have plenty of time to plan an appropriate joke for April Fool's, being as it's about 360 days from now. So. <laughs> well, sometimes. All the time in the world. <laughs> sometimes you need time to plan these things, right? Yeah, so you're not swatting <laughs> your neighbor's house claiming, <laughs> you know, have the police come over and. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Kick the door down. It's not funny. It's not. Have you ever swatted uh, any celebrity houses? No. 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 Oh, no. I would never do that. Has anyone done it to you? Well, <laughs> I one time I I tried a little <laughs> joke. I was like, oh, I'll play a joke. So I, I called Michael J. Fox. I <laughs> said, oh, hey, this uh, it's Martin Scorsese. How are you? <laughs> Of course you, you know. You, you do, do you do a good Martin Scorsese? I put on a voice, you know. Uh, can we hear it right now? Hey, yeah, that's right. How's good. it going, Michael <laughs> J. Fox? You Ma Martin Scorsese here. I, you know what? You fooled me. Yeah. So, you know, I called him. I said, "I have a new role for you in a film," and he got all excited. And I, I told him it's a film about. A documentary about Benjamin Moore. <laughs> Benjamin Moore. <laughs> and he got very excited. He thought he was going to have a big role. And then I said, no, you're going to play the paint shaker. <laughs> <laughs> and it was in poor taste. <laughs> very poor taste. <laughs> and I said, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> he, he, is, he does have a sense of humor. So <laughs> then he's, well, he had squatted, done that one of those swatting things to my house. So yeah. it was a payback. It was a payback. <laughs> Benjamin Moore. Police came and shot my cat. <laughs> I was like, whoa, mittens, what happened? Oh, no. So I had to get them back. <laughs> well, good. <laughs> what, what, are some, what are some bad ideas, things that maybe we should not do for uh, April 4th next year? You may not want to go to a bar, pick up someone, and, you know, hook up with them, and then go, oh, yeah, I have AIDS. No, no, not, not, Never. no. Not a good thing. Not because, funny. You know, and then call, well, it's funny if you call them six or seven days later. <laughs> six or seven, no. Nah, I was kidding. <laughs> no, remember, any time the police arrive or there's uh, health issues involved, it's not funny. Yeah, I guess not. Yeah. Waking your child suddenly at 3 a.m., and telling him the entire cast of Paw Patrol died in a fire. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. You might think, wow, this is a funny. <laughs> no, no. My it's child's going to be like, oh, God, no. Please tell me no. Well, you know what's you disturbing know, like, is that actually that thought actually crossed your mind. Yeah, you know, you, you let them go back to sleep. <laughs> You're right. You wait till they're home from school the next day. Oh, and then go, you didn't do it. April Fool's. <laughs> no, no, no. Got you. No. You should see your face. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> you, you don't want to trick the kids. Never want to do that. No, what else is I up? learned from my mistakes. <laughs> you? you should, you yeah, know. Right. My son's been in years of therapy <laughs> as a result of that one. Right. <laughs> therapy. <laughs>